Hey everyone, I'm Sean Morley. Welcome to this Shop Saver Minute. All right, let's talk a little bit about the vacuum table. There's a lot of misconceptions out there, a lot of things that people think need to be done. As you can see, we got a spoil board here. There's no gasket on the table. There's no gasket on the spoil board. We can just set it in, turn the vacuum on, suck everything down, and I'll slide this into place here. All right, we've got that slid in place. Now before we turn the vacuum on, I wanna talk about this sheet here. We've got half inch Baltic birch, and as you can see, this thing is severely cupped. Normally we'd flip that over, but today I wanna to show you the power of this vacuum. In today's video, we've got a Becker VTLF 2.25. Shop Saber's always gonna recommend the appropriate one, but this is what we got today. Let's turn it on. We got the vacuum pump on. Now let's take a look at how it works. If I pull this apart, you can see nothing's glued down. There's no gasket, anything. Let's push it back in and open those valves up. We still got that big cup here. Push it down, make sure it's already down there. Sucked it right down. You can see it. I can't move that at all. Let's go over here so we're not pushing on the pins. And it just doesn't move. That's just how well a pump works. Now we got the vacuum off. We can hear a little bit better. One thing I do want to point out, we're using just standard MDF, not high density, nothing special, just the basic stuff. Be sure to surface both sides of it. Once you do that, put your workpiece up here and you can get to work. Now, if you want to see more videos like this, be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching this Shop Saver Minute.